In Los Angeles, USA, you are unlikely to find anyone in the streets. And we sought to find out how Kenyans who are living there are faring. So we spoke to Dr. Aquilas Muteti. Remember, we featured him on Daring Abroad some time back. He runs a unique insurance scheme that helps those who've lost their loved ones deal with bereavement and the cost of funerals. And he sent us the following clip. I'm in front of my residence and uh, the most interesting thing that you can notice that um, as I show you through the streets is completely empty and uh, everybody is afraid schools are down um, as I'm doing this uh, it is actually March uh, the 18th is actually um, Wednesday and schools are out until April 3rd but there is word from the governor of the state of California that uh, uh, there's a possibility that schools may not resume until this coming summer. So again, um, all we can say is that we want everybody to stay safe, clean yourselves, clean your hands before you touch anything. Don't touch your face aimlessly. The key is that uh, everybody needs to stay safe so that we can uh, try to eradicate this virus. Thank you so much, Dr. Muteti, for that update from Los Angeles, USA, on how Kenyans are faring in that city. Remember, you can contribute by sending us a video to show us what is happening where you are, and you can send to the number on your screen. That's a WhatsApp number. Until we get other updates, bye-bye.